Well, I'm off to visit my family. Whoa, how long have we been sitting on this couch? Feels like we've been here since July. Or was it August? Okay, see ya! Wait, what? <laughs> Dan, don't leave us! Remember what happened last time? Look, a clone. Ah, I'm evil. Plus, you're the Christmas chef. And somehow, the food's actually pretty good. Well, you all could come on the trip with me. No. Ugh. Alright guys, before we go in there, I must warn you. My family could be pretty crazy. Yeah, I bet. Dan! I'm so glad to see you. Oh, by the way, son, you left this here from last visit. Whoa! Thanks, Dad! I've been looking for this everywhere! I see you brought your little posse! Hi. You know, the inside looks oddly normal compared to the outside. Oh, that was from Dan's last visit. Oh yeah, I remember that! I also remember trying coffee for the first time! And then going Christmas caroling at the library! All I want for Christmas is you! You, baby! We had a lot of good times that year. Yes, we did, son. Now put your pants back on. We didn't need to see that. I hate my life! Well, now that you're here and settled, I'll go get your brothers. Careful, guys. They're a real bunch of weirdos. We don't need more versions of you. Ah, uh, thanks Nathan. You know I'm the best version. They're coming! <laughs> Quick, take cover! Hey bro! <laughs> How's it going? Come here. Uh, hi Donnie! It feels like a whole year since I last saw you. Bro, you didn't tell me you were in a boy band. Hello, brother. Oh, hi, Denny. So, have you done anything productive in society yet? Um, I did try going to the store by myself recently. Well, I'm off to the store. Wait! This isn't the door! Oh, wait. I don't have money. Fascinating. Well, I'll be in the kitchen. Weird! He's just getting a snack. There's nothing weird about that. In fact, everything your brother's been doing has been normal. I don't get it, they're nothing like you. Yeah, why'd you call them weird? Because they are! I mean, look at them. Dad said I can eat all the cookies in the cookie jar and that you and Dan can't have any. Seems pretty normal to me. In fact, the only weird thing is all the pencil decorations. What? They're not weird! I put them all up myself! He super glued all of them, so we can't take them down. That explains everything. Look who I found! It's Grandpa! Billy! Is that you? Grandpa, I'm glad to see you're still alive! Same to you! Now change my diaper! I also brought my friends! They're not white, are they? <laughs> okay, that's <laughs> enough, Grandpa. I don't know how much longer I can take it here. Hey, kids! I'm really glad you boys are friends with Dan. He's always been the odd one out, never really fitted in anywhere. But he found you boys, and howdy, I'm so glad for that. He could have been evil or something. Uh, no problem? I think we all appreciate being Dan's friends. Sleep over time! Spoke too soon. We're gonna have the funnest and bestest sleepover! We can sleep in my room with a light up and there'll be snacks, but not too many snacks. We can watch scary Christmas movies and play my favorite game, Wild Woody! What do you guys think? Why does this 
taxi keep looping? Now guys, wasn't playing with me and my room fun? I wish I brought a gun to shoot myself in the face. That's the Christmas spirit! I knew you guys would love it here. Not really. Hey Dan, we need you for the dinner. Oh boy! I'll be right back. You guys, stay cool. Okay, be back soon. Bye, Nathan. Okay, I think he's gone. Look, guys, we've got to do something about this situation. I am not staying at Dan's dad's house for Christmas. What makes you think we do? Yeah, I've got to get home and feed Fluffy. So what you got for us, Dan? My special... Red Soup! Let's eat! Uh, Dan? What'd you use to make this? Oh, you know, tomato juice, beets, carrots... Oh, and eraser shavings for coloring! Oh, I'm full. Mm-hmm. Alright, great! Now we can do family fun activities! Alright boys, get some sleep. We got a big day tomorrow. Well, good night guys. We have to get out of here. But how? Dan's dad locked the door from the outside. Why the heck would he do that? <laughs> Dance time. Oh, that's why. Okay, that's it. I'm getting out of here. Since when was there a giant picture of Dan here? Oh. Oh yeah, the hole in the wall. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. Okay, but shouldn't we change out of our pajamas first? Wah. Kazi Ah! What are you guys doing out of bed? We should be asking you the same thing. Um, okay, well. Every year, Dan always tries to open the presents early. So Dad puts me and Danny to guard the hallway from him. So yeah. How the heck does Dan try to do that if he's asleep? Well, obviously he... Sleep dances. Of course. Yeah! Well, we tried. Got any bright ideas? I know. To beat Dan, we gotta think like Dan. We gotta beat him in a dance-off. All of us? Let's just get this over with. Step aside. I'll take the lead. I am the best dancer in the house, after all. Trust me. Alright, everybody. Just do what I do. We are... Denny and the Roommates! We're in a boy band? I do not agree with that name! I hate everything right now. Let's dance! Dancing? Forget that, man! I'm not doing that sh- He'll be knocked out until morning. All thanks to Dan's friends. Also, I'm back! Great. Maybe we still have time to leave. What time is it? It is, uh... 7.59. Well, now it's 8. It's Christmas! Come on, let's go open the presents! And so the roommates and Dan's family went to go open presents. Oh. A pencil sweater? Oh, you love it! The other boys also got a gift. It was one of Dan's favorite green pencils! Soon, they all ate the Christmas feast, and after that, 
said their goodbyes. After getting seated in the taxi, Nathan grinned and finally stated, You know, this visit wasn't so bad after all. Really? No, I was being sarcastic.